Well, Elliot Giles, of course, the 800 metres European bronze medalist from 2016. The six national titles under his belt as well. Have to see him make a comeback after those serious injuries when his car swerved into her motorcycle, of course. Forced his way back and uh, how refreshing is it to say that as well. Made his way very quickly to the front and look at that, someone's pulled out already there to the side of the race, early doors. Pacemaker, Adam Zawinski of Poland has himself a decent at personal best as well, 3.41.20, doing his job very, very quick pace already here, doing his job and doing it well. Giles, as expected, likes to be a front runner and he's very neatly positioned in second behind the pacemaker. Expect to see plenty of these athletes also on the calendar. There's so many events up and coming as well later on this month. Just a handful of events also in the back end of February. And it's over to the rest of the pack here to try and get themselves a decent time. Well, the pace is steady rather than spectacular. Giles is there, Dibjani as well. Muyad now from eighth up to third. And the pack now just beginning to bunch up now, not so a lap ago. I'll be delighted to hear the bell coming up shortly. So, 3.46, 21 so far we've seen from pretty much most in athletes. 3.38 as well from Piers Copeland of Great Britain. Just heard the bell. Giles now in second place. Looks like he's got enough gas in the tank just to click up through those gears. He has indeed. He's turning on the afterburners here. Is Giles. Well, he was the poster boy for this event coming into it. And here's the reason why. Well, he wins easily. 3.35.93. A new meeting record in the men's 1,500 metres. Brilliantly done, that was, by Elliot Giles of Great Britain. Time to perfection. Almost three seconds have been shaved off the previous meeting record. Bibic, who held it off Serbia from 2020. Well, that meeting record is going to take some beating, I have to say. A national record also for our second-place finish.